Detection of phishing websites using machine learning. Abstract phishing is a common attack on credulous people by making them to disclose their unique information using counterfeit websites. The objective of phishing website URLs is to purloin the personal information like username, passwords, and online banking transactions. Fishers use the websites which are visually and semantically similar to those real websites. As technology continues to grow, phishing techniques started to progress rapidly and this needs to be prevented by using anti-phishing mechanisms to detect phishing. Machine learning is a powerful tool used to strive against phishing attacks. This paper surveys the features used for detection and detection techniques using machine learning. Phishing is popular among attackers, since it is easier to trick someone into clicking a malicious link which seems legitimate than trying to break through a computer's defense systems. The malicious links within the body of the message are designed to make it appear that they go to the spooked organization using that organization's logos and other legitimate contents. Here, we explain phishing domain, or fraudulent domain, characteristics, the features that distinguish them from legitimate domains, why it is important to detect these domains, and how they can be detected using machine learning and natural language processing techniques. Keywords phishing, personal information, machine learning, malicious links, phishing domain characteristics. I introduction. Nowadays phishing becomes a main area of concern for security researchers because it is not difficult to create the fake website which looks so close to legitimate website. Experts can identify fake websites but not all the users can identify the fake website and such users become the victim of phishing attack. Main aim of the attacker is to steal bank's account credentials. Phishing attacks are becoming successful because lack of user awareness. Since phishing attack exploits the weaknesses found in users, it is very difficult to mitigate them but it is very important to enhance phishing detection techniques. Phishing may be a style of broad extortion that happens once a pernicious website acts sort of a real one memory that the last word objective to accumulate unstable info, as an example, passwords, account focal points, or MasterCard numbers. All the same, the means that their square measure sum of contrary to phishing programming and techniques for recognizing potential phishing tries in messages and characteristic phishing substance on locales, phishes think about new and crossbreed procedures to bypass the open programming and frameworks. Phishing may be a fraud framework that uses a mixture of social designing what is additional, advancement to sensitive and personal data, as an example, passwords associate degree open-end credit unpretentious elements by presumptuous the highlights of a reliable individual or business in electronic correspondence. Phishing makes use of parody messages that square measure created to seem substantial and instructed to start out from true blue sources like money-connected institutions, online business goals, etc., to draw in customers to go to phony destinations through joins gave within the phishing websites. Two state-of-the-art, literature survey. H. Wang et al., 2009, proposed the frameworks that distinguish the phishing utilizing page section similitude that breaks down universal resource locator tokens to create forecast preciseness phishing pages normally keep its CSS vogue like their objective pages. S. Marshall et al., 2017, proposed this technique to differentiate phishing website depends on the examination of authentic site server log knowledge. An application off the hook application or identification of phishing website. Free, displays a couple of outstanding properties together with high preciseness, whole autonomy, and nice language freedom, speed of selection, flexibility to dynamic fish and flexibility to advancement in phishing ways. Mustafa Aden ETAL proposed a classification algorithm for phishing website detection by extracting website's URL features and analyzing subset-based feature selection methods. It implements feature extraction and selection methods for the detection of phishing websites. The extracted features about the URL of the pages and composed feature matrix are categorized into five different analyses as alphanumeric character analysis, keyword analysis, security analysis, domain identity analysis and rank-based analysis. Most of these features are the textual properties of the URL itself and others based on third-party services. 
Samuel Marshall ETAL presents FishStorm, an automated phishing detection system that can analyze in real time any URL in order to identify potential phishing sites. FishStorm is proposed as an automated real time URL phishingness rating system to protect users against phishing content. FishStorm provides phishingness score for URL and can act as a website reputation rating system. Fadi Thapta ETAL experimentally compared large numbers of ML techniques on real phishing datasets and with respect to different metrics. The purpose of the comparison is to reveal the advantages and disadvantages of ML predictive models and to show their actual performance when it comes to phishing attacks. The experimental results show that covering approach models are more appropriate as anti-phishing solutions. Mohamed Bikara ETAL proposed an application which is known as Anti-Phishing Simulator, it gives information about the detection problem of phishing and how to detect phishing emails. Spam emails are added to the database by Bayesian algorithm. Phishing attackers use JavaScript to place a legitimate URL of the URL onto the browser's address bar. The recommended approach in the study is to use the text of the email as a keyword only to perform complex word processing. 3. Project Description We have developed our project using a website as a platform for all the users. This is an interactive and responsive website that will be used to detect whether a website is legitimate or phishing. This website is made using different web designing languages which include HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and Django. The basic structure of the website is made with the help of HTML. CSS is used to add effects to the website and make it more attractive and user-friendly. It must be noted that the website is created for all users, hence it must be easy to operate with and no user should face any difficulty while making its use. Every naive person must be able to use this website and avail maximum benefits from it. The website shows information regarding the services provided by us. It also contains information regarding ill practices occurring in today's technological world. The website is created with an opinion such that people are not only able to distinguish between legitimate and fraudulent website, but also become aware of the malpractices occurring in current world. They can stay away from the people trying to exploit one's personal information, like email address, password, debit card numbers, credit card details, CVV bank account numbers, and the list goes on. The dataset consists of different features that are to be taken into consideration while determining a website URL as legitimate or phishing. The components for detection and classification of phishing websites are as follows. 9. Domain Registration Length Based on the fact that a phishing website lives for a short period of time, we believe that trustworthy domains are regularly paid for several years in advance. In our data set, we find that the longest fraudulent domains have been used for one year only. 10.favicon A favicon is a graphic image, icon, associated with a specific web page. 11. Using non-standard port This feature is useful in validating if a particular service is up or down on a specific server. 12. The existence of HTTPS token in the domain part of the URL. The fishers may add the HTTPS token to the domain part of a URL in order to trick users. 2. Abnormal based features. 1. Request URL. Request URL examines whether the external objects contained within a web page such as images, videos, and sounds are loaded from another domain. 2. URL of anchor. An anchor is an element defined by the attack. This feature is treated exactly as request URL. Three links in meta, script, and link tags. Given that our investigation covers all angles likely to be used in the web page source code, we find that it is common for legitimate websites to use meta tags to offer metadata about the HTML document, script tags to create a client-side script, and link tags to retrieve other web resources. It is expected that these tags are linked to the same domain of the web page. 2. DNS record. For phishing websites, either the claimed identity is not recognized by the HOI database or no records founded for the hostname. If the DNS record is empty or not found then the website is classified as phishing, 
otherwise it is classified as legitimate. 3. Website Traffic This feature measures the popularity of the website by determining the number of visitors and the number of pages they visit. 4. Page Rank Page rank is a value ranging from 0 to 1. Page rank aims to measure how important a web page is on the Internet. 5. Google Index This feature examines whether a website is in Google's index or not. When a site is indexed by Google, it is displayed on search results. 6. Number of links pointing to page The number of links pointing to the web page indicates its legitimacy level, even if some links are of the same domain. 7. Statistical reports based feature. 4 algorithms used. 2 algorithms have been implemented to check whether a URL is legitimate or fraudulent. Random forest algorithm creates the forest with number of decision trees. High number of tree gives high detection accuracy. Creation of trees is based on bootstrap method. In bootstrap method features and samples of data set are randomly selected with replacement to construct single tree. Among randomly selected features, random forest algorithm will choose best splitter for classification. Decision tree begins its work by choosing best splitter from the available attributes for classification which is considered as a root of the tree. Algorithm continues to build tree until it finds the leaf node. Decision tree creates training model which is used to predict target value or class in tree representation each internal node of the tree belongs to attribute and each leaf node of the tree belongs to class label. Thus to summarize, we have seen how phishing is a huge threat to the security and safety of the web and how phishing detection is an important problem domain. We have reviewed some of the traditional approaches to phishing detection, namely blacklist and heuristic evaluation methods, and their drawbacks. We have tested two machine learning algorithms on the phishing website's dataset and reviewed their results. We then selected the best algorithm based on its performance and built a Chrome extension for detecting phishing web pages. The extension allows easy deployment of our phishing detection model to end users. We have detected phishing websites using random forest algorithm with an accuracy of 97.31%. For future enhancements, we intend to build the phishing detection system as a scalable web service which will incorporate online learning so that new phishing attack patterns can easily be learned and improve the accuracy of our models with better feature extraction. 9. Future Scope Although the use of URL lexical features alone has been shown to result in high accuracy, 97%, fishers have learned how to make predicting a URL destination difficult by carefully manipulating the URL to evade detection. Therefore, combining these features with others, such as host, is the most effective approach. For future enhancements, we intend to build the phishing detection system as a scalable web service which will incorporate online learning so that new phishing attack patterns can easily be learned and improve the accuracy of our models with better feature extraction.